Welcome back to Midnight Who Extra, and today we are taking a look at some Doctor Who items that I was really excited for when they first kind of announced them. They are the new Doctor Who Target novelizations, based on, of course, stories from the new series, which I think is awesome. I really hope we do more of these. Uh, there's, of course, one more book based on the new stories, which is The Christmas Invasion, and there's also one based on the classic story of Doctor Who, City of Death. Uh, which I do not have yet. I might get those in the near future, but I picked up three of them to start. And I will actually review one of them today, um, which will be this one. So let's start with it, which is Rose. So there's the cover, which I think is a really cool cover. You got Rose, the Doctor, a couple of wontons, and a really kind of cool art style to them. I really do like it. There's the spine, and there's the back of it. Nice to meet you, Rose. Run for your life. This novel is based on a Doctor Who story, which was originally broadcast on the 26th of March, 2005, featuring the Ninth Doctor, as played by Christopher Eccleston, with his companion Rose Tyler. Now, of course, this is this book. This one right here is about 197 pages, and this one is actually written by Russell T. Davis, which I thought was really cool. The next one is. The Day of the Doctor features the three Doctors in that story. The War Doctor, the Tenth Doctor, the Eleventh Doctor, and a Zygon and a Dalek. When the entire universe is at stake, three different Doctors will unite to save it. The novel is based on a Doctor Who story which was originally broadcast on the 23rd of November 2013. The Target logo on top, and it is just BBC logo on that. And to conclude the first batch I got is course, Twice Upon a Time, written by Paul Cornell. Silly old universe, the more I save it, the more it needs saving. Based on a Doctor Who story, which it was originally broadcast on the 25th of December, 2017. Another, all these though, all of them have really awesome... So, like I said, I'm going to review one of them really quickly, which was Rose. Now, of course, I really do like the episode of Rose, so I was really hoping that this novel would be just as good, especially because it was written by Russell T. Davis. And I was right. This was a great novel. It really felt, it, pay, it was perfectly paced. It started great, and it start, ended great. You know what I mean? I really liked it. Now, of course, what I really liked about it was, of course, with Russell T. Davis writing it, he added a little bit more to some of these scenes. I really liked that. So, of course, some of the things he added was, of course, the, you know, the Clive, which I thought was really cool about this with Russell T. Davis writing it was that he kind of expanded upon a few things. One, of course, being Clive, of course, the man who was kind of obsessed with about the Doctor and figuring out who he was. And there's a lot more in that scene. And, of course, in the story, Mickey was taken over by an Auton. And this story does feature that, but also adds a bit more to that, which I thought was really cool. And, yeah, I really liked it. It was also just kind of fun reading this story that, you know, of course I watched a lot of times. And I also thought it was kind of cool was, was also the prologue here talked a bit more about Wilson. Which I thought was really kind of cool. Of course, Wilson, we didn't really know much about him. You know, we just knew he was in the basement and Rose had to go down there and give him the lotto, lottery winnings. This was a great Target book. I really enjoyed it. And I... I can't wait to read these two very soon, because if this one was as good, I'm hoping that these two will be just as good. So that is it for tonight. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video, and of course if you like this video, you can click the button that kind of looks like that, and click the subscribe button and that bell to see every single one of our videos every Monday and Wednesday at 7 o'clock Pacific Time. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye everyone.